Next up at UFC 281, we have Andre Petroski taking on Wellington Terman. Andre Petroski, 8-1 and one overall, 4-1 and one in his last five. He is riding three UFC wins in a row. Wellington Terman is 18-5 and five overall, 3-2 and two in his last five, riding a two-fight win streak. Couple things to note in this breakdown. First, Andre Petroski is in that Henzo Gracie gym where they've been bragging for years that all their UFC fighters are undefeated and they have just been absolutely shit in the bed. Every single one of them. When Jake, Jake, you and I were talking yesterday and, well, what did you tell me about that gym and their fighters? Uh, they all, well, let me be nice because people get upset. No, you they told me something are... genuine. I don't remember what I said then. You said that none of their striking has improved at all since they've been in the Oh, gym. yeah, that's what I was going to say. They, their striking it absolutely sucks. I mean, that's just what it comes down to. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Okay. So, Andre Petrosi's part of that gym. If you believe in the karma of a gym, he's on the wrong side of it right now. And Wellington Terman is training with Glover. He's been with Glover for a while now. He's training with Glover. They've got Alex Pajeda in there. And they now have freaking... Dominic Reyes is in there as well. Dominic Reyes went from California to Connecticut. Connecticut. To be training with Glover. moves you could ever make. To be training with Glover and Wellington and Alex Pajeda. So, you know, it, it's not going to affect my pick, but those are some interesting things going on here. I do like Petrosky to win this fight because ultimately he's the, the heavier hitter in the striking. He's going to hit harder. Is he the more technical striker? No. Does he hit harder? Absolutely. He's going to get the takedowns whenever he wants them. And he is at that Henzo Gracie Gin getting good rolls with great grapplers. He's rolling with Pat Sabatini. Great grappler. He's rolling with, um, you know, your boy that just got smoked. Great grappler. While Wellington Terman is also a great grappler, I don't see him catching Andre. I think Andre gets the takedowns, controls, beats him up. I do think Andre Podrowski wins this fight. I'm actually pretty confident in that. But if you guys believe in the gym karma and all that crap, then that's not great. What do you think, Jakey boy? Yeah, this is a. Uh, there's two people on this fight card that are kind of like Mr. What's it, Mr. Jekyll, Doctor Hyde, Doctor Jekyll, Mr. Hyde. <laughs> like, what is that phrase? Is it Mr. Jack? Is it Jekyll and Hyde? But isn't it like a doctor? What about the doctor? Yeah, Doctor Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Mr. Hyde. Okay. Well. Wellington is one of those people. If he is on your back, if he is in a advantageous position, he is a very, very good fighter. I mean, he is a very aggressive fighter who will look for submissions, and and he is a problem if he does get in your back. But if he gets on his own back, and you're on top of him, you saw that in the Misha fight. He was on Misha's back. He looked good, body triangles, threatening submissions, and then Misha threw him off, and it was almost like Wellington was like, oh, shit, like, what do I do now? He didn't even have, like, a full guard. He was literally, like, blocking punches, like, trying to, like, catch punches in the air. Like, and Misha's just raining down terror upon him. If Wellington is able to get the back in a scramble somehow against Andre, who should know what to do in those scrambles positions, as you mentioned, with that good Henzo Gracie camp with all the, the grapplers they have, you know, maybe he can come out and win this fight if, you know, something weird happens. But this should be an Andre play all the way. I think he's very confident play in this matchup. He should have the wrestling, the control, the double legs. Wellington should be able to get taken down easily because he is a jiu-jitsu guy. I like Andre all the way. If, you know, if this, for whatever his reason, stays on the feet and he gets knocked out just like those Henzo Gracie guys have been doing, I'm not, hey, I'm not going to be surprised because I've seen it twice now and it uh really kind of pisses me off, but... I think Andre's a play. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm pretty confident in it because Wellington's only chance is a flyer submission, which is possible. He just did it to Misha Serkinov, who's a very good grappler. But Andre has power in his hands. He's not a great striker, but he has, he has just straight-up raw power in his hands, and he can wrestle, and he can grapple. So I do like Andre Petrovsky here. So do you. Luis Rodriguez said Jacob outstrikes all. The Gracie Gym fighters. Oh, here we go. You people love when he does this stupid shit. Okay. I'm, I'm there in there nice and tight with these. Look at that. I'm, I'm, I'm here. Boom. I'm slipping like this. I'm slipping like this. I'm coming in like this. Boom, boom with the double up. Now I'm coming. I'm slipping like this. Oh, you look oh. like a cat playing with one of those stupid. No, I'm ripping. I'm, I'm ripping bodies like that. You see that? You see how you, that's the key. I here, see. Guys. I see how your chin see, is not protected. You, you see, absolute no, buffoon. No, no, I'm right here. Boom. Boom. Okay. I mean, I, you yeah. see how I good really talk. get no, good that talk. lat. I mean, if you guys are looking okay. at this lat right now, 
that's what you really need to just dig. I mean, you're digging like, yeah, 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 Anyway. That's Mike Tyson work there. Um, That's called Driss- a picky boo. We have Driss- We're called a Big D. Big, nope. <laughs> Big D. DV, damn, there is magic in the movement. Don't, guys, don't encourage. I appreciate the super chat, but don't encourage his bullshit, please. Please don't. Please don't. Um, anyway, Andre Petroski at, Andre Petroski at $9,200. It's a lot of money, but I honestly think he's worth it. And I could be, you know, listen, Wellington has freaking Glover on top of him, grappling with him every day. He's got, he's got <laughs> Alex Pajeda throwing missiles at his head every day. Like, you know, he, he's, he's literally got two of the he's best in the Dominic world. He's got Dominic Reyes telling him that he beat in, John Jones every day. In a month, in a month, that little tiny gym in Connecticut could have two world champions of like two of the toughest weight classes. Toughest meaning... You know, like biggest, strongest so weight classes. Relative. Yeah, not tough, like hardest to become a champ in. Those are always the little lightweight classes. But anyway, I like Petrosi. So do you. Ninety-two hundred dollars, probably worth it. Again, not touching the monkey knife fight strike line because this could end quick. This could be a quick fight, one punch KO, a quick submission, or it could be Andre just laying on top, sloppy. Let me, sweaty. Let me look at something real quick before we before we get off this. You want like a little Saturday flyer here? You want a little mm-hmm. Saturday live stream flyer? Because I'm not going to be live Saturday. Give me Wellington Terman by submission round two and three. Because Andre is a guy that will do powerful stuff. He will get tired. And at, when you get tired, you can't get submitted. We have Wellington plus 1,500 for round two, plus 1,800 for round three. Give me a couple of those as a flyer, just as a hedge on the Andre play. Yeah, honestly, that's not terrible. Because I know. if Andre gets comfortable with listen, the if I if I say it and it's a, if I say that it's a Saturday live stream bait, uh, live stream bet, you can almost take that to the bank. Don't take, don't no, actually but, take no, but you bank, shouldn't. But, yeah, but you absolutely should not. Yo, you skip D, man. Oh, I didn't see it. I'll go back up. Dollar ninety nine from Luis Rodriguez. Tip money for the shadow boxing. Look at you. You like the guy with the no, 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 no. You didn't read that whole thing. That's what it said. No, you didn't. You left that a word. Tip money for the elite shadow boxing. I said yeah. that. Nah, I think you didn't say elite. You said for the shadow boxing. I think your brain like canceled it out because <laughs> you're okay. like, that's not elite. And I had Go. DV. I'm, no, I already read D. This one. Oh my God, D. I'm so sorry, man. What is it? Member for seven months. I am enjoying oh, all the work. I don't get that. Doesn't in. show up as an alert on my side. Sorry, my bad. Sorry, Thank D. you. For seven months of membership, thank you for appreciating all the work we put in. This actually is a ton of work. I know it doesn't seem like it because we just show up doing this, but... It's not work for me because I love it. <laughs> okay. Every time I ask you for something, you get hem in your haul. I absolutely love this. This is not work for me. Thanks, guys. I, we appreciate you. Angela doesn't like you guys. I love you guys. 